So these are the parts of a basic scaper set. There is an air cylinder. This particular one is a composite tank. It is wound, very lightweight. This contains the air that the user is going to be breathing off, under high pressure, obviously. And there is a harness. The strap on the harness that supports the tank. There is a first stage regulator that drops the pressure from the tank to an interstage pressure where it is fed to the user through a demand valve which connects to the mask. Harness also contains a pressure gauge so that the user, wearer, knows how much air they've got left, how much time they can breathe off the tank. Finally, there is a mask that the user wears to a positive pressure respirator, so the user wears this and they breathe using this mask. This is the basic parts of a scaper set. These are the basic parts of a scuba set. There is an air tank, typically made out of metal. This one's aluminium. There is a jacket which supports the tank. The scuba, the jackets are called BCDs, buoyancy compensation devices. So they actually have a bladder you can inflate or deflate to help control your buoyancy in the water. So the diver wears one of those. Attach the tank and attach the jacket, there is a set of regulators. Scuba, similar as a first stage, which generates an interstage pressure, which goes down to a demand valve that the diver wears in his valve. Scuba, it is traditional to have a backup air source. And of course there is a pressure gauge, so you can monitor your air consumption, how much air is left in the tank. And, scuba diver has wears a mask. So they breathe through their, their mouth, through the demand valve, which allows them to see in the water, and also fins, so that they can manipulate themselves underwater. So this is a basic scuba set. If we compare the weights of a scuba set and scuba set, a scuba set comes in at around 12.8 kilograms in weight, whereas a scuba set comes in at around 26.9 kilograms. So the scuba set is lighter than the scuba set, which is great if you're working above water, which is what the scuba set is designed to do. However, when underwater, the scuba set is superior, as the breathing regulators are actually designed to work underwater, and the extra weight of the scuba set is compensated by the buoyancy in water. For fun, let's just see if the scuba set can actually function underwater. 